I want me to say for the back of another deck review, this is the Flex deck. I know it's not going to flex for you, but it's a flexible deck, technically speaking. <laughs> it's just it's got flexibility to play different games, I uh, guess. And it shows you some of the cards on the front. It says all in one, traditional ace king cards, double nine dominoes, crossword, and letter games. It says made in USA, mix the classics on one side, pick how you play on the other. Don't most people do that when they're playing games. And then uh, something on top that I can't read under the seal. One deck, many games, something like that. Oh, I had a copy on the bottom. This is from 2020. I don't believe this is the original version. I think it has a different design, perhaps. This is from 2020. The back says flex deck. Be a fixed and unbending principles. The first of which is to be flexible at all times. And includes 55 multi-purpose cards. And you can check out instructions on their website, flextechcards.com. Link in the description. A little ad copy. And standard USB C seal, which is not quite where it should be. <laughs> With uh, some trademark stuff on the flat, interesting enough. And a Flextech logo. Now, I'll tell you a little bit the creators of Flextech which I think was a Kickstarter project years ago, could be wrong. Um, they wanted to take multiple games out on a backpacking trip, but that was gonna be a lot of weight and space to take all these games, so they said, let's just put them all on some cards. And they did that, and that was the birth of Flex Tech, and they decided to actually produce that for the general public, so pretty cool. So you get a card that has some rules for some games and this side basically tells you what I just told you, I think. No, it doesn't actually say it on either side, but mm -hmm. just some rules basically. And then you get three jokers slash some wild cards. This one has green and blue, it's a two and a seven. It actually told you for the dominoes. The numbers, in case you can't count dots for some reason. <laughs> this one's a double O, and it's blue and red. And this one's red and orangey color. And those are your jokers. The back, of course, just says flex deck, some stars. Very simple, classic looking. And then the rest of the cards, basically the same thing. Here's the Ace of Spades, which is also the Z or Z depending where you are in the world. And it's the 8-0 Domino. All the cards are like that, different letters, different colors. It is a four colored suit. Spades are in green, clubs are in blue, diamonds are in orange, and hearts are of course in red. Every card has different letters, different dominoes, and of course different playing card indexes. Some people obviously big fans of this, some of you probably or less, but it does look really colorful and it's pretty cool. It's not the first one I have like this on my channel, I believe. It's one of my USB C, the Ericus Infinis, and it feels like a premium stock, like a V stock. It feels pretty thick and sturdy and not like a crust stock, so obviously not a crust stock. So, yeah, pretty nice. I like it for what it is. I will, for what it is, I will give it an 8 based on, you know, just what it is, the type of deck it is. Not necessarily based on art. I'm just rating it based on quality and, you know, functionality, I guess. That is that. Comment, rate, subscribe, or let me know what you think. That's the Flex Deck. And check out the website again, flexdeckcards.com. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.